Hey guys, if you're also wondering where did this girl go after doing her plan April 2021 with me, with you, then let me tell you, I am back. Hey guys, I'm Shreshtha and welcome back to my channel, This Might Help. I know it's been a quite a while that I've uploaded any video and I'm going to tell you just why, where was I, what I was doing. So this is going to be a super casual video where we're going to do some chit chat and hopefully a very short video as well because the whole point of doing this video is just to tell where was I and why didn't I upload the videos when I said I'm going to be all regular. So without any further ado, let's get started. It feels so good to be back you guys. Hey guys, sorry for the interruption but uh, I just was editing this video and I realized for whole 8 minutes I was out of focus and that's why I'm again filming this section for you guys and it's a super casual video so shouldn't matter that much I guess so. So yes, sorry for the interruption but let's get back to what I was saying. So uh, last to last month I decided um, that I can just go and travel back to India. Situation was much better here in UK and India, India as well. But still, bahut sari restrictions or guidelines thi and only permitted reasons ke saathi you could have you know traveled. And uh, when I decided to travel, one of my reasons were coming in the permitted reasons by which I could travel. So I went back, visited my friends and family. Mujhe kuch zada, thodi zada holidays thi compared to my husband. So I went um, you know way before him. So and. I was there for in India for about one one month or so I was uh, yes in India so I went back followed all the guidelines um, I live in Delhi so I went there did home quarantine and everything spent as much as time as I can with my family and after that my home quarantine or job test ho gaya, I uh, decided to meet few of my friends did that and then I went to Punjab where my in-laws live and my rest of my uh, you know uh, holidays I was there with them so the point comes how I traveled back so disclaimer here I have not traveled yet it has a lot time and at that time India was not in the red list for UK travel and there were no cases there it was much better when I went back to India and you uh, had restrictions the, and because of some valid reasons only you could you know travel back and I had one of those valid reasons did all the um, documentation required for it everything done and also of course negative RT-PCR test to chahiye tha COVID ka and uski report bhi milti and you get a a uh, fit to fly certificate as well so wo london heathrow mein got tested and phir mera flight tha from london heathrow to new delhi to ye sab hua and uh, my husband as i said joined me uh, way later uh, for just for few days only and then it was my sister in law wedding as well uh, which was decided long back but since the situation was not that good we decided to have a very close knitted and uh, following all the guidelines kind of a wedding so say family members there was a very small small very very small intimate wedding but we had fun because at least we had our families with us or family maybe just the very close family members we couldn't call uh, everyone and that was fine so wedding hua and then after that after few days um tab india red list mein aa gaya, um, in uk so uk has a uh, different list of um, countries when you come back to uk you have to follow different guidelines so when india came into the red list usi ke around hamara flight tha to, to come back uh, when we came back here we had to do a mandatory hotel quarantine uh, and we pay 2500 pounds for uh, almost like 10 days of hotel quarantine hota hai. so we pay 2500 pounds which is near about 2.5 lakh um just for the hotel quarantine it was a very difficult and a very different experience i would say and of course agar hota ki india would have been in red list we would have never um traveled back and mai to aur bhi pehle se thi so it was like it just happened that way anyway so we came back did the hotel quarantine and everything is sab mein content aisa nahi hai completely forgot about the content and about you know my youtube and everything uh, but the point was ki um, i had some uh, pre shooted uh, videos unko sirf edit karna tha but trust me when you uh, are with your family members you just want to spend most of the time with them that's what i did so i didn't edit anything and um, i was like it's okay um, i'm getting um, 
this time to spend with them and I have to make the most out of it which I did so um, I have lot of pre shooted videos and also I tried shooting some um, vlogs while I was in India wedding care around because it was very small knitted so we didn't do so much so but I was still wanted to you know record for your own um, uh, when you go back and look at it you just for your own happiness right so I was like I tried to vlog a little bit but most of them are unfinished not gonna lie so I have to go back through all that um, clips and videos I filmed and see if I can do some vlogs that would be wonderful if that happens so yes what can you expect from this channel now what can you expect in terms of um, consistent regular content and that's uh, we're gonna go again get back to productivity mindset changes and all those kind of videos but I'll also try to see if I can do some vlogs and I'll post them regularly every Thursday like we used to um, another thing which I really wanted to talk was about um, how situation in India um, with the COVID became so much worse uh, and as a nahi hai, everyone is affected by it um, I am here with my husband but we still have all our family members our close ones back home and um, it's kind of uh, very difficult and sad because when you're so far away you are so anxious with how drastically things change there and um, uh, wo rehta hi hai. and plus social media at this point is becoming a very difficult place to be and for content creators also we don't know like what sort of content we can put out and content creation ke liye bhi, you have to be at a place where you're you know happy and you are at peace to do it so all of that also takes time but um, I will try to you know at least create some content which helps you in this difficult time at least helps you to take care of your mental health and your physical health because I know still at few places there's still lockdown even here in UK we still have certain restrictions which we are following and um, and we everyone should follow all the guidelines so yes that's that and um, all I want to say is please stay strong take care of yourself take all the precautions I know at this point most of us are just tired but hang on there this shall to pass you guys um let's just pray together for good times i have hope and hope and faith are big things um and they will change the situation so yes with that i'm gonna say a goodbye and yes meet me next thursday and every thursday from now on with the new video i'll be back as i promised and um i hope you're all staying safe stay safe and stay strong and yes take care you guys i love you all bye bye